Oh, see, to you, the FBI out of Baltimore, Maryland, all you gang stalkers, all you uh, FBI agents that hire uh, loads of criminals in the, in the community to target an innocent American, and, uh, and the ones that really think they're uh, on the up and up, well, you, you, make, you make kids yourself and tell yourself that you're on the up and up. Meanwhile, you aren't saying a damn word about what's going on there at the FBI. What, did you get scared of what they did to the whistleblowers? So your job's more important than American lives, right? Is that it? Is that what I'm getting? Yeah, that's pretty much the case. Yep, they made examples out of those heroes that came before Congress and whistleblowed on the FBI. And you all continue to work every day like nothing's amiss, huh? As innocent Americans are targeted over their freedom of speech. In my case, a complaint about the Anne Arundel County Police Department, uh to the FBI out of Baltimore, Maryland, and a little argument I had with Fred Barnes, who works for Integrated Solutions. Shortly after that, the felony stalking and harassment began in 2016, and has continued to this very day. You know what? To those who don't come out about this, sooner or later, it's going to come out, and I have a sneaking suspicion that some of you all are going to be in serious trouble. Uh, if you have any heart, any conscience whatsoever, if you have any belief in God whatsoever, and you work for the FBI and know about this crime called gang stalking, which, which has like, what, the community organized gang stalking? Well, we all know when you organize a thousand people in a community to, get, to gang stalk one individual... Uh, like Las Vegas shooter, Mr. Paddock, and this other shooter. You gang stalk them with all these people, and you know the guy has high-powered guns and all. You know that you're, you're trying to get him to orchestrate a mass shooting. So you're actually setting up the people that you hired to run a person out of town for disaster. You know it. I know it. Many others know it who are afraid to say anything. I'm not afraid to say anything. Organized community felony gang stalking by loads of liberals who target a conservative. A lot of times a conservative who happens to be a gun collector. Like Mr. Paddock, the Las Vegas shooter. And uh, and the one shooter that just got uh, they found dead up in Maine, I guess it was. Then there was the Navy shipyard shooter. And there was Myron May. Yep, you got the whole community come up against them over lies and fraud. And then experienced a mass shooting. You caused it. The FBI, Homeland Security Fusion Centers, and many other ABC agencies created a Manchurian candidate to use as an excuse to destroy the Second Amendment. You guys orchestrated a mass shooting. No doubt in my mind, and no doubt in many other people's minds. If you work for the FBI and you're not saying anything, you are just as guilty as the ones who created the Manchurian candidate to orchestrate a mass shooting. I hope you can live with that. I hope you can go to sleep well at night for you know doing you know doing those kinds of things. Absolute ultimate ultimate evil things. Henry Eberhardt here in Glen Burnie, Maryland, in the Marley community, targeted by criminals with badges. Guess what? I won't be moving. You won't be running me out of my community. I've lived here all my life. I've always been a supporter of civil and constitutional rights. You won't be running me out of my community.